How would you like a job where you have your own VIP jet to fly around? A mansion to live in when you get home and an impressive holiday house for that weekend getaway. You get a nice salary, of course, and your own fleet of cars to take you wherever you need to go. And if you really want to, you can even fire the Prime Minister. You're fired. It might surprise you to learn that this job actually exists. It's called the Governor General of Australia. And at the moment, it belongs to this woman, Quentin Bryce. She became our first ever female Governor General, or GG, back in 2008. But now, it's time for someone else to take over. That someone else is this guy, General Peter Cosgrove. If the general bit didn't tip you off, the uniform will. He served in the Australian Defence Force for a long time and even became its chief. He's known for leading international forces in East Timor, helping the country become independent in 1999. After he retired, he kept busy, leading the clean-up after Cyclone Larry hit in 2006. Now Prime Minister Tony Abbott has asked him to be the new GG. But what does it actually mean to be the Governor General? Well, you might know that Australia is a monarchy, which means we have the Queen as our head of state. But because she's all the way over in England, she has a representative here. That's the Governor General. While the Governor General doesn't really have much say in how the country's run, they do have some important official business to take care of. It's the Governor General's job to make sure everything is done by the book. They have to approve new laws and officially appoint new judges and government officials. The GG also has some serious power. They have the ability to give the PM the flick if there's a really good reason. So Governor General's not a job to be taken lightly. And aside from all that super official government stuff, there are still heaps of other responsibilities. You have to travel around Australia and represent the country at big events overseas. You have to take part in heaps of community events and meet a lot of people. Like, a lot, a lot. And when you're sick of that, you have to give a speech or two and meet a few more people. Still think it sounds easy? Well, if you average it out, the current GG, Quentin Bryce, has been to more than one event every day since she started the job. So while it might sound like fun, it's also a lot of work and responsibility. That's what the new Governor General, Peter Cosgrove, can look forward to when he takes over and helps to represent Australia in the best way he can.